Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing Thai marriage visas and the financial requirements associated therewith. Specifically, uh, the kind of thrust of this video is going to be uh, the income requirement. And I got a comment on a video recently that said, how do you prove your 40,000 baht monthly income to immigration? Just curious. Uh, first of all, for those who are unaware, on a marriage visa, Thai O marriage visa, there are two ways to deal with the financial requirement. One is a lump sum of 400,000 baht in a Thai bank account. Another is 40,000 baht a month in proven income. And this can lead, this can actually lead to some very precarious circumstances with Thai O marriage visas. Some years back, we actually saw uh, circumstances where Thai O marriage visas were being refused renewal because people were using the income, uh, they were trying to meet the income requirement, but they never left Thailand. So there would be income into their bank account, they were married, and these were generally people under the retirement age, under the 50 year mark. And basically the reasoning behind this was from Thai immigration it seemed to be, that look, you know, okay, retirees, they're on a pension, they get, you know, if they can beat 40,000 a month, you know, we'll give them the, the marriage visa extension every year but we're, we're kind of looking at it through the paradigm of a retiree. For younger folks, uh, we found, we, I saw two cases like this, like five years, six years ago. Uh, they happened within a couple of months of each other, oh, marriage visas, which were denied extension based on, uh, based on an, an inability to show where they got the income from. And basically immigration said, look, we think you're working in Thailand illegally. We're not gonna give you a further extension. And ultimately, we got the situation resolved, but in one case, it required work permit issuance. Uh, and, and in cases involving income, work permits, Thai work permits, are one of the most straightforward ways of dealing with that overall issue. But if you're residing in Thailand and you're basically not leaving, and you're under what's deemed to be the retirement age of 50 here in Thailand, and you're using income, that can be a really sticky wicket. I've seen immigration officers over the years say, yeah, we're just not going to allow that to be renewed. So again, it depends on circumstances. I'm not saying this is an end-all be-all video about all sort of permutations that can come up with respect to O marriage visas, but it's definitely something to keep in mind, especially with respect to the income requirement associated with Thai O marriage visa renewal. 